Oh, jam! Hello again, welcome back. Oh my god, that's so loud. Hmm. Okay, let's try this again. Oh, jam! Hello again, and welcome back to another episode of Let the Wookie Win. Hi there. Thank you, Daily Quests. So I'm... Oh, we're not in story mode yet. No one can hear me. I'm Chewie. And we're playing Magic Duels. And I'm trying, again, to finish Liliana's campaign. You see, the final boss, the demons, have been giving me problem. So, you know, I restyled my hair, shaved a little bit, so hopefully they won't recognize me. Give me such a hard time. Alright, here we go. We got this, right? I'm not, uh, I'm not sure how we win this. I got a few bits of advice, but none of it actually helped. Other than pay more attention, which, easier said than done. Alright, demons, yes. Scribbleburn, yes. Lily still has purple hands. This game is really freaking loud, dude. Oh my god. Alright, we got all the swamps, the Lord of the Undead, and an Intuko Husk. Which gives us no early game whatsoever. But surely we'll draw something. Oh goody. Rats. Just what I've always wanted, just some rats. Okay. Oh, we drew a kitty. We're good. Oh, no, why did I? Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh, God. Oh, it hurts. Oh. Oh, well, so much for playing that Leech Root and Swamp ever. Bad at this game. See what I mean? Pay more attention. I was so excited that I drew a kitty. Meow. Stop playing things. Oh, my God. Ooh. Okay, Rice from the Grave helps a lot. We're gonna go ahead and get a kitty out there to take out one of these. I don't really care which one. The Death Touch holds off the big things that I get back with the Rise from the Grave. And the Child of Night gains him life, so either one he wants to attack with, I will gladly block. He's gonna attack with both. Let's block the life gain. <coughs> and choke a bit. I want you to discard a card. What kind of a dumb question is that? What was that, a mind rot? I'm okay with that. That I'm not okay with. Uh, hello, Corrupt. That will be glorious in just a short period of time. Uh, let's go ahead and throw out the Nintuko Husk because I can get these back with the Lord of the Undead later, so I'm not terribly worried about losing resources now. This is how I know my hair is too long. See, when I can do this, and it just stays there. This is a major problem. Continue, damn it. Pay attention. Oh my god. Alright, so whatever you do, don't mind rot me, bro. Uh, I'm gonna... Block this thing again. Having him gain life once is bad enough, but multiple times, just... No. And I will gladly just take one... several times and be okay with that. Alright, taint funny, McGee. Lord have mercy. Oh my god, a second corrupt. Okay, alright, 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 alright. Well, now I can play this. Play out the Lord of the Undead. Next turn, I can start getting stuff back. In theory. This is the, like, most aggro... Oh, there, me and my big mouth. I was gonna say, this is the most aggro start that Grizzlebrand has had against me that didn't involve a huge flying thing. And, oh, me and my big mouth. No, I'm not gonna sacrifice a creature. Bite me. No... 18 children of night up in here. Good lord. Alright. And there's nothing in here worth using a rise from the grave, and nothing in there worth using a rise from the grave. Next turn I can corrupt his big guy, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yeah! And that will be glorious. Uh, do not sacrifice a creature. Oh, wait a minute, I should go ahead... Yeah, skip attack. I'm not gonna attack. I'm not gonna attack. Thank you, thank you. Alright, I should go ahead and use this now so I can cast a creature. Yep. Get back the kitty. Yes. Give me the kitty. Oh, I got a kitty. And cast said kitty. 
can help block another child of night. What are you buying? What was that delay? Okay. <laughs> Do I really want to play this swap? Eh. Yo, GB. Wake up. Oh, you're a jerk bag. Alright. You discard a card you don't have. Dang it! No, I'm not gonna sacrifice a creature. Quit asking stupid questions. I am, however, gonna kill that next turn with one of these corrupt Yep, I'm almost dead. That's great. Whatever, whatever. Give me something good. Swamp works. Alright, kill this. Thank you! Next turn, we can rise it from the grave. I'm not gonna block with this, so I might as well attack. Yep, get in there. No, oh, don't stop the timer. Wrong button. Oh my god. It's terrible. It's terrible. <sighs> yep, I'll take three. Thank you. Thank you. This is insane. Like, we're totally gonna rise from the grave. You're demon. Yes. Excellent. And then I'm gonna go ahead and get back. I'll get back to Kitty. Yeah, I'll get back to Kitty. Again. In case he draws a Mind Rot, I can now discard two Not Corrupts. So thank goodness for that. Yes, by all means, sacrifice a dude, you idiot. No? Okay. It's worth a shot. What are you gonna do, huh? You've only got one card. This should not take this long. He sacked a dude to tap my guy. Really? Why? Okay, so again, the AI is stupid, and even though the AI is stupid, I still can't win, so, you know. Who's bad at this game? Well, that would be me. Alright, I'm gonna hold a Cruel Revival for something worth it. Go ahead and play the cat, I guess. So I've got two massive bits of removal for whatever he plays. We're actually in really good shape right now. Go ahead and attack for half his life. Yes, yes, yes. Dig this small badger out of my eye. Alright, your turn. I just have to remember to stop the timer during his end step to use this, just in case. Because I need to get in the habit of that. Barony Vampire, alright, not a problem. He sacked his Death Touch guy. Alright, so we're gonna use this first. Lose life. And then we're gonna get a zombie back. Yeah, this one. Alright. Cool. Ooh, and I have a bone splinters too? Man. Okay, first things first. Let's kill this chump. Okay, first things first, let's deal him four. Man, if he's gonna keep doing this, this'll be great. Yeah. Then I'll play a husk. Okay. Uh your turn. I'm not gonna use this in case I need to use the cruel revival. It's just a swamp. Alright, so Grizzlebrand is dead. And we have a crow. I really wish that I was paying attention. Okay, so we're gonna continue. Swing with this to kill him. Draw some more cards. Things and stuff and things and stuff. Yep, get in there. Your turn. To die. Okay, Grizzlebrand is gone. Who's next? Was it Bells and Lock? Razaketh. Right. Oh my god, look at all of this. Could life get any better? Another leech ridden swamp? Thank you. A pretty bird? Thank you. Mana open for a cruel revival? Thank you. So after struggling, and I did one that you guys didn't see, I have absolutely no reason to attack with anybody ever in my life. And I take 10 next turn and die. Awesome. After struggling, oh, he drew, oh, he drew cards too. Oh, that's a small problem. Hmm. I don't even have any zombies to get back. How awful is that? Oh, Barony Vampire. Don't care. Don't even. Not a single, what? What is taking so long? 
do something. I know you're gonna, you're afraid you're gonna die, but delaying me is not going to delay the inevitable. <laughs> okay, sorry. I am clearly a big idiot. How are you guys doing? You guys are. Oh wait, he's doing something. Oh, it's another Barony Vampire. Okay. Not really. How are you guys doing? Am I good? Okay. Attack step. He'll miss. And step. Stop. Yeah, we're we're totally gonna uh, use this. Yep. Stop. Okay, don't stop. That would, I didn't actually need to stop. Okay. That's probably another swamp or he... Well, he might not have played it. Either way, I'm not gonna bother knocking it out of his hand. Are you gonna sack something? You are not gonna sack something. Okay. Because we're just gonna swing with the big guy. Has he got a murder? I bet he's got a murder. Oh no, he's just dead. Alright. That's, that's fine. I am okay with that. He draws some cards. I'll draw some cards. Everybody cards, cards. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right, we have to play something. Let's play our shambler. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, your your turn, bells unlock. Eh, <laughs> bells unlock. I made that joke last time. What you got, huh? What? Oh, you got a swamp. I want everyone to realize how insanely lucky I have been this game. That he has drawn no more than one of his huge, ridiculous beaters. And I just happen to have a way to get rid of it, and then a way to... Okay. Uh, but a way to beat it, uh, to kill it, and a way to get it back. Um, okay, we're gonna lose the Shambling Goblin and a Swamp. Why? Because I, I want to have something to Cruel Revival back. Come on. You're gonna die. Just fess up. Well, I mean, you're clearly not gonna attack. Unless you've just given up all hope. Oh, and he's given up all hope. All right, hold on. Okay, so I can just block with these two and no one will ever care, right? Okay, just checking. Okay. Hooray for giving up hope. Oh, sorry, you discard a card at random. It's a land. Ho ho! It was a, gi a giant huge beater. Oh my god. What have you got now? Typhoid rats, okay. Stop. We're gonna use this. Stop. We're gonna use, give me that. We're gonna use this. And then we're gonna use this. Gonna get back our shambler. Shamble, shamble. Oh, end of turn step is the best step. And I got back a grave digger. Oh, I just noticed, I, I, Whoops, I don't have a sacrifice outlook for the goblin. <laughs> Whoops! Alright, hang on. Let me get my sacrifice outlook back. What am I doing? If I might have enough swamps to corrupt Kothafed when this guy dies. Oh, okay, well that guy, yeah, he still dies. What am I, wa I'm sitting here just massively wasting time. You're gonna attack, and you're gonna attack when I'm out. Okay. Whoa, zoom out! I have so much on the board, we had to zoom out. Did you see that? That was cool. All right, your turn. All right. I'm not gonna kill you until you're in step, just so you know. Oh, it's your in step. Yup. Yup. Okay, so you're dead. Is it Kothafed now? It's gotta be, he's the only one left. Yeah, there he is. Buh. Okay, and he's got 12. 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 12. Alright. This was seriously so much easier than the other attempts. Like, you just don't know. Oh, I'm at 8. Look at that. This is the greatest game ever. Oh, the freaking rats. I love them so much. Oh, golds. All right. Go get him, Lily. Lily, honey, did you fall down? Are you that old? Did you break a hip? Oh, hello. 
Yes, we're all very impressed. What a ah, I need an adult! Bad touch! Oh, that's beautiful. I used to use... Oh, purple's my favorite color. This is so hot. Yeah, she loves purple, see? Okay, well... Oh. The demons te the demons test your skill and though pushed to your limit, you prove your worth. Maltrefity. They etch their contract into your flesh, granting you youth and unspeakable power in exchange for your servitude as a planeswalker. But what good are contracts if they can't be broken? <laughs> I added in the laugh. It doesn't it doesn't say that there. All right, Lily. And we're done. Cool. Well, that's Lily's story. Up next, we have Nissa. No, not Nissa. Who's this? Chandra. I jumped ahead of myself because of the daily quest, but I'm not going to fool with the daily quest. I'm doing these in order. So up next is Chandra. Leave me a comment down below. Let me know why that one was so easy. Like, you guys saw one attempt, and by now I'm sure I've peppered in at least a clip or two from the other attempt, the full... Uh, length of which you will not see because it's miserable. Yeah, it doesn't matter. We're still dead. Like, I was visibly pissed off the whole time. A freaking battery's gonna die before I finish this. Oh my god. It took me like 40 minutes to lose and for the, a good 15 or 20 of those minutes, I had no hope of winning. But I thought I might have had a teeny hope. See what I mean? Like, now it's snowballing and we're gonna lose and it took freaking 20 minutes this is awful and I missed a couple things because I was trying to keep up commentary why is he still alive because I'm clearly the biggest idiot ever that's why and it was just awful there is no reason to keep any of this huh <sighs> but this was just like I win I win I win I win I win yay I, I don't know I, I guess I just got on um, either really unlucky those last few times or super lucky this time I'm willing to bet it was the last one super lucky this time so leave me a comment let me know how you did how many times did it take you to beat it this was awful for me I just wanted I wanted to die those first two times I was playing it and then I did because they're demons I guess I can lose the disguise now huh huh yeah eat your heart out Superman yeah anyway like this video if you enjoyed it subscribe if you want to know as soon as new videos go up if you want to help support what I do Check out the Patreon, you can get stuff early if you so choose, or you can get your name on the Inslate after every video, which is pretty cool. Chandra, set things on fire, I can't wait. I might just record that now, but I'll have, I can't lose the skies that quickly, so maybe not. Anyway, anyway, thank you all so very much for watching, and uh, go play some Magic Duels with four ancient demons, including our favorite, Grover. And there's the weirdo, bizarre, grizzle brand hook hand that he's got going on here. I heard the question asked, we might have asked it, how did he get his metal pants on? If this is what he's working with here. I don't have the balls to ask him, do you? Doing it. <laughs> oh god, what? <laughs> Seriously. That was no challenge at all. I am seriously confused.